What's up guys, I'm Rasim from RasmerTech.com and this is another tutorial in Java programming. Now in this class I'm going to show you guys how to use the string data type. So let's get started. Now unlike the character data type, the string data type can hold more than one character. You can actually have a whole sentence and store it in a variable. So we start off by typing in our string uh, here. So we start off by typing in capital S T R I N G, right? Remember it's important, it's a capital S and the rest is lowercase, we hit space, we got to give our variable a name, we could call it whatever we want, I'll call mine green, right, hit space, we got to make it equal to something now, we hit space, now we use the double quote, a set of double quotes, unlike the character, the character uses a set of single, and again, uh, with a string a data type, you can hold as many characters as you want, it could be, doesn't make a difference, you can actually have whole sentences, and you can type in whatever you want, so I'm going to type in a sentence. I'm going to type in, hello, how are you? All right, end it with a question mark here. And also, we have to end this with a semicolon because it is a statement, right? So I declared a variable, which I call green, and it has a string value, right? And I made it equal to this sentence here. So let's print that out on the screen. To do that, we're going to type in system.out.println, and it's capital S, lowercase y, S, T, E, M dot out dot print ln open and close parentheses and it with a semicolon. Now in between this open and close parentheses, we're gonna type in our variable name, which is green. Now let's see what happens. So I'm gonna hit play here. And as you can see, I printed out our sentence here. Uh, that's pretty cool, right? Guys, I'm gonna show you how to concatenate other strings and numbers. So I'm gonna start off by creating another string here. We're gonna type in capital S lowercase t r i n g hit space we got to give this one a another name we're going to give our variable a name so i'll call this one blue hit space we're going to type in equal here we're going to hit space and add another set of double quotes here right so in between this set of double quotes i'm going to type in this is All right so now at the end of this here i'm not adding a semicolon because i'm not done I'm going to hit space, and I'm going to add this plus symbol here. This plus symbol will concatenate whatever you want to this. It could be another variable at the end of this. It could be another string. It could be a number, whatever you want, and it will add it to this string value here. So let's add a number here and end it with a semicolon. This is an actual number with a numeric value. So let's try to print it out on a screen and see what happens. So I'm going to type in blue here, and I'm going to hit play. As you can see, it printed this out. This is two, and I printed out two here. We can, instead of two, we can say, we can add another string here. So let's add another set of double quotes here, right? And in between this set of double quotes, let's type in uh, a blue ball. So let's uh, hit play again here, and it prints out this is a blue ball, right? So we can add, uh, another string in a string, we concatenate it by using this plus symbol here, right? We can also add another variable. So I'll show you how to do it right now. Let's delete this here. Let's add variable green here. To do that, all we have to do is just type in the variable green. It doesn't have to be in any uh, single or double quotes. So just type it in and make sure you end it with a semicolon. And this plus symbol here will, will concatenate the two together, combine them. So let's hit play again. And as you see, it says, this is hello, how are you? That doesn't make any sense, but you get the point. So that's, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys like this video, please give me a like. If you want more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm Rasim from RasimerTech.com, and thanks for watching.